Good afternoon, folks. Welcome back to another episode of Third Day Angling. We're at a canal here in Chandler again. Got the BFS setup. Gonna be throwing the meta crawl. The only thing I'm kicking myself about is I forgot my net. It's a little bit steep here. It's about a probably about a seven foot drop to the water with this limber rod here. So kind of curious how it's gonna play out. And trying to land these fish with this light setup so we're gonna give it a go here it is a hot one today the outside temperature in the in my car on the way here was 111 right now it's probably about a hundred and I think it said 108, 107. It's definitely getting up there. I did hydrate today and I do have water with me. these stairs a little bit Ah, something hit it right now. I don't know if you can see if you saw the line jump, but something small there hit it. I'm throwing this with a 16th ounce bullet weight Texas rig. Oh, that just broke off. Oh, that was a good one. And they have that drag set too. All right, let me get tied on and we're going to go back at it again. <laughs> Got tied back on. Checking that drag. The drag is pretty good. It actually broke at the, at the knot with the leader. So I had to tie on a new leader. This is what I was worried about is trying to get him up here. Well, it's a nice size bass. Let me see here. They like a flip on. Able to get him. Woo nice. On the 
Met a bass crawl, so it's not a bad sized fish. Alright, let me get a good release on this guy. Nice. First one of the day on the better crawl. I'm liking it. Liking it. There's another one. Right down the bank again. Right on. Right on top of the mouth again. Nice. A little smaller, but... They're all right down the bank. Right now it's all feel because I can't really see that line. I'm throwing 10 pound braid to, I thought I had some four pound, six pound test in here. I didn't have anything in my small bag except three X tippet. <laughs> For my fly rod and that's what i have as a leader and look i caught two fish on there already ah, i had one all right let's go back over there There's a little shade spot right over there. All right, I'm gonna get a drink of water because like I said, it's freaking hot out of here. So I'm gonna get a drink of water. We're gonna get back at it. All right. Had to get a little hydrated here for a second. Oh yeah. I'm gonna pick off every little piece of shade I can see on either side. There we go, there's a small guy. Oh, he came off, darn it. We're gonna right down the bank, right at the oh there we go. Stay down. Oh, got a roll. Top of the mouth. Let me see. This is number three. Darn it.
And I'm just dragging it when I'm throwing it across the the canal because there was another one. That's a little guy. We're going with that metal though. You do pretty good right here. Let's hope there's. There we go. I was just gonna say, let's hope there's a bass here. What did I get? A tilapia? Yep, I sure did. No, 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 no. Oh. He ate the other claw. No, it's still there. I felt that thud. Okay. That's a nice one. Pretty nice one. A little over a pound. All right, folks, we're gonna call it a session today. Uh, came out today with a, to the canal with the with my BFS set up when I saw Noya Dragon Rod and Spirit Fox reel. Came out to the uh, canal here in Mesa, Chandler, whatever it is. Can't get this hook in here. All right, there we go. All right, came out here. Got about four or five bass. Missed a couple of bass, broke off one. Got a tilapia. Other than that, I mean, it was a pretty good day. This uh, BFS said it performed good in the canal. I was a little worried about how. I was gonna flip these bass up on the canal, but did pretty cool, pretty good, pretty tough rod. So I'm gonna call it a night. Be back out here again with this BFS setup. Let's see if we can get some more bass. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Be posting more videos every week. Until next time, tight lines, and God bless.